should be a fascinating afternoon's play. It's too short for Mason. And it's very easily dealt with third over now, James Franklin. And he strays down leg side as well. And that's been helped on its way for another boundary. So they're just a little off line, these two opening bowlers. Jai Sari just helping it on its way. Oh, he's helped that one on its way. That is a big hit. Up go the arms. Very good cricket shot, almost on the up. again it's a reasonably quick outfield the timing wasn't good this time that's gone that has gone a long way that's got wings on it you've got 285 and you think well we're in this game well you are but at the moment the chase is superb banged away fielder out there but not too close enough to it first bounce for four that's another bad ball just don't set a field for this kind of stuff. And it's too short. And uh, directed down leg sides. I mean, that is just so easy for JSRE. He just swats that sort of stuff. And no fine leg. Fine leg's up. A lot of shot play really, it hasn't been slogging. They've just put bad balls to the fence. To the fence and over it. That is a beautiful cover drive. 23 deliveries. My goodness, he's clubbered that. He has hit that as hard as any cricket ball can be hit. He's making this look like a club attack. Well, they're making themselves look a bit like it at the moment. He's a terrific player, but he's getting a lot of help. Over the top. Now, will it go all the way? Not quite. First bounce. Fine shot. Jaya Surya given an exhibition here of stroke play. We have seen Jaya Surya dominant for a decade and more. And this is top, sh top stuff here. That's a beautiful cricket shot, but it is a half folly right in the slot to hit straight down the ground where Vittori has not got any protection for Adams. And that'll go to the top, nifty played, he'll say intentions from the beginning, shocked everyone. And here he is doing the same thing here. No one will get that, no one will get that. He was no more than, what, five or six yards away from that. Had no chance of getting to it. Andre Adams walking back to his mark as if to say, well, it's want to get this over and done with quickly instead of perhaps slowing things down a wee bit having a chat to his captain trying to work out a few things it's just superb hitting but that's short and wide and they will have talked long and hard about when not to bowl to this bloke it's high now will it go all the way it has the elevation exactly 100 required now by Sri Lanka it away and that is a boundary and goes again another four short and wide and he's clipped it away for another boundary well two balls a day as though you said 100 to win now it's 90 that's the rate that it's run chases progressing along at Ten runs and two balls, both short deliveries, one pull for six, one cut for four. Poor old John Bracewell, uh, gee was uh, he's doing the right thing by trying to create depth. I wonder about their efforts too. Oh, he's gone again. And this one pitching. Runs and four of them for Jaya Saria. He's just been a little bit wide, Plunkett. Harmison's been right on target. Plunkett, fractionally wide. No need to run for this one, I don't think. He's hit it well enough. Slightly short. That's gone. Gone a long way. Will it make it? 
No, one bounce. That was almost six, number 202. In his one day career in this area. And with that particular shot. There's a the charge again. Turn the gap on the offside. As I said, this is going to be very interesting to see how Mahmoud and Bresnan need to be school batsmen. Will that go all the way? It does. Six, number 202. Short and wide. Charges in the... Opens his blade over cover point. Well, that's going fine. That's going to race away. It'll... Uh... Little glanced at all in a power play here. Field is up. Guy is down the pitch and he's got one six over cover. And that one's just one bounce short. Captain, why did Strauss take his power play now? Easy to be wise after the event, but why take it when two batsmen are in? Oh, well, where's that gone? straight over Geraint Jones's head and again short I think it was a slower ball yes it was 67 miles an hour but same result four runs that's a flick over square leg this is the last over of the power plays in Sri Lanka's innings and Sanath Jaisaria is trying to make Keep doing that he's so organized there are no fielders over there I'll maneuver the ball Leg side again, short again, same place, same result, back foot, four. Well, he'll have to change it now, and he's going to get a lot of advice. He's going leg side, and it's gone all the way. Guy Saria has his second six. I think this might be four. Yeah, it's a really short boundary. I mean, this was nothing more than a just a forced dab. It's a fast outfield as well. Just a chess match in A few more here, I'm afraid, for Jamie Darimple. It's been an expensive final over. 13 runs from it. That's fine. This is the danger of aiming at leg stump and just outside trying to stem the flow of runs on the other side that's beautifully tucked away very very fine indeed and it's just got enough legs on it to take it all the way for four that's actually a very very good shot it wasn't a bad delivery at all and yet somehow That one in the air between the two gullies and the three slips or the two slips. That's gone for four. That's the first boundary of the game. So very fortunate for Jai Surya. Picking up four runs in the process. So he's uh, served cricket very well so far. One cut away hard. Son of Jai Surya in his favorite area. Match. Not easy though. And that delivery just short outside off stump, and that's the area that Sanat Jaisuria is looking for. Uh, Antini there. That's nicely timed. A chase here for Adams. And this is another teaser. Once again, the ball will win, but it's made the fielder chase the ball all the way to the boundary line. Paul Adams had, uh, you know, felt that he could have uh, got to the ball. But the ball really moving away gradually and reaching the boundary. Yes, uh, Adams won't want to stretch too much. He's uh, back after an injury. And this is a tremendous shot of the back foot. No need to run for that. Consecutive boundaries here for the Sri Lankan captain. Very strong on the square side and he's given the room there and punched it Ooh. 
and three boundaries on the trot. Score motoring along at this stage, 64 for no loss. Well, Senate Jay Syria in full flow now. Jay Syria brings up his 50 in style. Good shot. Oh. Well, he starts with a dreadful delivery. That's a full toss, almost waist high outside off stump. And you could not. And he's got that one away as well. That's gone through the extra cover field. And a run away. That's the third boundary in this over. So Paul Adams starts the first three deliveries. And the crowd here, yeah, well, they're enjoying this. Hey, bisecting the field is. His timing's been very, very good when he's on his stride. Now, Joe Surya obviously is going to attack Paul Adams. Now, the key is for him now is not to make a mistake. He's done the hard work first three deliveries it's probably mentally has the ascendancy right now but a bit of width offered to run Jay Surya and well any width to Jay Surya and that brings up the hundred partnership that's another boundary over pitched and Jay Surya is a man in form he's put that away comfortably And that's another one. He's gone after that one. You give him width, and he doesn't mind even taking the aerial route in a test match. That's reached the boundary in a flat. And he's now cutting loose here. Once again in the air, but once again he finds the boundary. Three boundaries. It's a landmark of uh, sorts about to be reached here. You don't often see. That's Abish. And it will reach the boundary. Now oh, that's spanked off the back foot. Rhodes is there in the deep. And even he can't stop it. Boya gets it up to Jay Surya, and I always felt it was a matter of time. As soon as he got it in third area, Jay Surya was going to have a go at it, and he's hit it well. Jay Surya, well, just past Paul Adams, and Jay Surya prepared to take him on. It's gone for four. Also, Jay Surya is always prepared to take Paul Adams. And Jay Surya goes for the big one. He's hit in the middle, and that's gone over the deep mid wicket's head. It's gone all the way at six. It's that one or mid wicket and it hits the meat of the bat. There's a man down on the line, but that's cleared him for six. Well, when Jay Sturia hits it in the middle of the bat, it stays hit. It goes with the wind. Jay Surya sweeping and sweeping extremely well. Just has this uh, happy knack of this with the shot. Just getting the gap right there. Wide the fielder down there, two fielders down in there. We're still attacking. We're still attacking on the onside. That's the second time he's found the boundary in the over with a similar shot. Gap and all the way down to the line. Yes, this is a very good shot because there's a man near the How about it? And immediately he smashes him away. How do you feel as a fast bowler when you do that? Well, I reckon he hit that one. Whack. Don't bother to run, Sanat. Oh, the is hauling it in. Forward straight through. Away. Flies off quickly of the face of the bat. Wasim Akram will be struggling there. Fast it comes out of the hand, faster it goes off the bat. It's gone over the top and uh, it's gone to bounce once 
before players like Sanat Jayasuriya, they would be defending Dali, not looking to hit, but anything offline. The attacking instinct just taking for two. That's kept over the infield and into the boundary. Now that's a very good shot. Bottom hand coming into play. And uh, once again, generating tremendous back speed. It was an ex excellent shot by Jai Surya. I think it was a slow ball but by uh, the Pakistan captain. He picked it up early, clipped it uh, over extra cover, and then he was successful in getting four runs there. That's why they're so dangerous. You might get a feeling that you've got the hang of things. A couple of overs are all nicely. Suddenly a flurry of boundaries. used to bat and to sprint that's this as well now will this go all the way definitely will fortuitous shot from Sanath Jasaria the result well something that he would be pleased about 111 for two it's a very well decided to fall oh he's cut that one beautifully That'll go flying into the board. Over the rope she goes and into the board. That's a beautiful shot. Just too short. It's the first one that he's really gotten to, to really extend the arms, get them through the ball. He's guided a couple before. And this one actually had the length and the width to hit it. That's gone through, beating the keeper. Leg by signal. Jasuri was trying to play it finer, but he was not uh, successful in uh, hitting it. But Sri Lankas managed to get four leg by. They are getting the runs that they need, so they really don't have to worry. It's just that they have to keep the wickets intact. They don't have to do anything silly. That's a good shot. Put away quite easily. Sanat Jayasuriya is first boundary. It's been a long time coming for Sanat Jayasuriya. It's not often he's into the seventh over before he hits his first boundary. But it's a good shot. Kept his eyes on it all the way. Picked it off. Pick the length quite well. Only his second boundary. Wrong length from Bradshaw is not quick enough really to trouble Sanat Jayasuriya with this length. Moved well inside the line of that ball and with fine leg up in the ring, it was a wrong choice of length from Bradshaw. Got it wrong. Sanat Jayasuriya got it right. It was way out of his crease there looking to attack Brett Shaw from, uh, from out of his crease. He's starting to feel it. Starting to feel that he needs to play his natural game. He's a very natural player, gifted player, Sanajay Surya. Great hand-eye coordination batsman. Very good strike. Sliced it, but it was good enough really to clear the infield quite easily. Not a problem whatsoever. Nice clean hit. Doesn't matter. Three fourths for Jasuria in four balls. From nowhere he's produced three smashing shots. He's very quiet and certainly is uh, now uh, being the son of Jasuria that we know slicing cut shot it's 
good hit. It is a good hit. It's gone all the way. He's turning it on for this final power play session. Sanif Jasaria after a slow start. What a magnificent straight drive. The best we have seen from Sanath in this inning so far. Clean hit, great pickup, straight as an arrow. Made it look extremely easy. Great balance. He came down the track. Keeper was back and beautifully put, put away. Washed it all the way. What a great feeling it uh, must have been. His uh, strike rate was languishing uh, in the 50s. Certainly it's jumped up to 82. Four boundaries and this majestic six is 237th of his career. It's a boundary. Picked up the slow delivery really well. He's now taking the game to the West Indies. Brian Lara now looks a worried captain. He's walking up to Dwayne Smith to get it right. I mean, margin of error is so minimal. You get it wrong, you pay the price. Had the fielder in mind, had uh, the field position in mind. This is where he's so good. Intelligent striker of the ball, Sana Jasuria. It's not about uh, slogging all the time. Very classy player, Sanaf. This is simply outstanding batting. Facial expressions tell it all. 83 for two. Pulled away. Now will he get it? He won't. That's a bad delivery from Gale. And dealt with by Jayasuriya. Short down the leg side. All this was going to be four. Especially in this mood. Once he gets his confidence up, uh, Sanat Jayasuriya is very hard to stop. They had gone through a little passage of play, which is pretty good. Eight balls without a run, and then this. And he's put it away. No trouble at all. What a shot. What a shot by Jaya Surya. He's heading out to Tamiri somewhere. I reckon that's worth 22 of one ball. <laughs> it's gone miles. I think a little bit premeditated, but Sanath Jayasuriya is so strong. He's a little pocket rocket, and it's just gone absolutely miles with a minimum of effort. He's on the acceleration, and this is danger for the uh, West Indies. It is a classic one-day shot. Just pick up and go. Picked his spot well. Knew that there was a long off, and the mid on obviously, in the circle. And it was a shot that he picked. 128 for two. He sees a different Sanat Jayasuriya. Showing so much maturity about his innings. Just looking for those empty spaces to hit the ball into. Unlike in the early days, just look for more, more, more and more. And uh, numerous fours. Not the best line from Bradshaw, but a very clever shot from Jasuria. This is why he's so good, Sanat Jasuria. As soon as the bat, the ball strays, just that fraction outside the line, just good enough to put it away, and also find spots where there are no fielders. And that really comes from the type of experience and uh, the intuition that uh, he brings into his batting. Oh, that's wonderfully struck again. Picked it up nicely. Great shot. It is an amazing shot. Almost a slug sweep. It's a shot that he's played throughout his career, really. That is an outstanding exhibition of power hitting and a good eye it's the bat speed and just look at the bottom hand testimony to the power he puts in uh, to the shots can't do much of that's gone straight to my deep but straight about square but oh he just parted it over the rope
absolutely brilliantly struck by Sanat Jayasuriya. The ball had the elevation in the end to escape Shivnarayan Chandapal's hands and arms. Well, that has found a gap between the two. Oh, that's just smashed away. One bounce four. I think he read the slip. Common sense. Oh, he's hit that one. It's gone all the way again. It's another six. Yes. Two metres over the boundary. He's whipped it.